we're going, Susan. Down to the Highclere Castle has been home to the Carnarvon family since 1679. Built on an ancient site, the original house was recorded in the Doomsday Book. The present day castle was designed in 1842 by Sir Charles Barry, the architect also responsible for building the Houses of Parliament in Westminster. The castle's history also includes a fascinating connection with ancient Egypt, as the fifth earl with Howard Carter discovered the tomb of Tutankhamun in the Valley of the Kings in 1922. The castle houses an exhibition that commemorates this historic event, including some rare antiques from the fifth earl's earlier Egyptian excavations. Just about to join the queue now. Fortune are not allowed to, to, to take any pictures or do any video footage inside the castle, so I'll see you on the way out. Ciao for now. Okay, so we've just left the house and it's exactly as you see it on the TV series. Um, two rooms downstairs that you don't see on Downton Abbey series are the gentleman smoking room and the ladies private sitting room which I heard the guide say when we were inside was actually Maggie Smith's private room for taking her tea when she first joined the cast of Downton Abbey. Also you go through the library which has been on many many um, scenes in Downton Abbey. That library contains over 5,000 books um, also on the way in, a lot of you will remember the portrait of the little girl, which is actually a portrait of a little boy. That's on there as well. Um, you go around the upstairs um, of the house as well, through all the bedrooms, and then you exit by coming down the um, grand staircase, just as Lady Mary did on her wedding day. Very me, that. Uh, we also went to the um, Egyptian exhibition where the fifth Earl of Carnarvon and Howard Carter excavated the um, tomb of Tutankhamun in 1922. I can honestly say it's been a really, really good day and I've been dying to get here for about 13 years. Downton Abbey lies in over 5,000 acres of estate. As you can see, the views are amazing. This is a statue of Capability Brown, 1716 to 1783. He was a gardener and a landscape designer. A famous bench in a lot of Downton Abbey scenes where different members of the cast have played out their troubles in different scenes underneath the big tree.
any avid Downton Abbey fan will know this is the place where Lady Edith used to run to in her fits of upset. We've had a fantastic day at Downton. We're just enjoying a snack and a drink and the sunshine before we depart for home. It's been a fantastic weekend. What's a weekend? Cheers. Cheers.